started and uh, you know we kind of inched our way into a lead uh, thanks to some good stops I think by our goaltender and you know a couple individual plays Jen Wakefield shot that not many people can execute at that pace and uh, you know goal to start the third and uh, I guess we figured we were we were uh, off and running and away with that one and uh, awful awful lot of credit goes to Northeastern for uh, you know putting on a great rally and, uh, and getting a tie out of the game uh, you know I was disappointed with our t our team uh, you know giving away a point giving away a a very very important point for us in the uh, uh, you know pairwise NCA standings and uh, you know again I tip my cap to Northeastern for finding a way to come back and win in the game and uh, or excuse me tie in the game and almost uh, win in the game. Questions? Coach, were you concerned about your team's intensity before the game? Seems the third time you played this team in five days and also it's a consolation game. Yeah, it's it's always tough, but I, I I thought it was the Northeastern pride up against uh, you know our our positioning and our situation in the, in the pairwise. You know that uh, it, it's still very important for us and very tedious. You know, there's a could be a big difference whether you're playing in uh, Walter Brown Arena or uh, you know one of the tough places on the road that uh, you know could be a Duluth, a Mercyhurst, uh, some place like that. And uh, so you know we're fighting to uh, uh, again go for something tangible. Where I think Northeastern was really fighting for pride. It wasn't a hockey East game. Uh, it may or may not be a game that influences their run into the tournament, but uh, uh, you know it was a big game for us. So uh, I was disappointed because I really thought we'd come out with more fire, and I thought we were flat. I thought we were legless. I, I didn't think we had much going in that first period. And again, because of some individual stuff, uh, we were able to build up a two nothing and then a three nothing lead. Uh, but we didn't show a lot of character or a lot of perseverance uh, to finish the job. Coach, the question seems to come up with ties, whether it's a point one, a point lost, or a point earned, and it seems like you're coming down on the point lost side of that. Yeah, I'm coming down on the point lost, three nothing with uh, 18 minutes left, and it was probably three nothing with 13, 14 minutes left, whatever, when they started their rally, and that's uh, way too many uh, goals to give up in that time frame, and uh, you know, way too many. Uh, less than good decisions for us you know there was some good execution by them but uh, we took some selfish penalties that uh, you know just continued the uh, snowball going down the hill and it was gaining more snow and more momentum and uh, you know more strength and, uh, and that was thanks to us on saturday you were concerned about the team playing um, as individuals too much did you see that in today's game in my opinion we did yeah uh, and that again we're uh, you know, not making the little plays. We're throwing a lot of backhand pucks across the ice. So maybe we could have made one more play to, you know, use a partner, or use a short pass up the wing. And uh, uh, again, we just uh, we didn't compete. I don't know if it was totally the individual thing, but there just wasn't a lot of fight or a lot of competing. Sometime in this game, you know, if the if things start going uh, the wrong way, it's it's hard to shut it down. But I like to think we have enough talent and we have have shown enough character over the year to to shut that down. But tonight wasn't the night, and so. Again, whether it's us or whether it's a, a wonderful effort by Northeastern, I, I think uh, probably credit goes both directions.